Thank you for watching this video. Today we're going to talk about how to upload your virtual tour that agentmarketing.com creates into your MLS ticket in your MLS, okay? Now if you're thinking, well, you can't do that because virtual tours are branded for me. That's correct. They are branded for you and that is against MLS rules and regulations. But we can offer you a MLS compliant virtual tour. Okay, so follow these quick and easy steps to upload that MLS compliant virtual tour into your MLS ticket because the benefit of this is when your broker's office syndicates your listing information to Zillow and Trulia, when somebody finds that listing ticket on Zillow or Trulia, they'll actually see that virtual tour and that virtual tour will be branded for you. So it goes into the MLS ticket unbranded, but it comes out to Zillow and Trulia branded, and they can actually click through to get to your property website. So an extreme, awesome, beneficial uh, factor for all of you agents. Okay, so I need you to log into agentmarketing.com, and when you do so, I need you to go to the properties tab, and I only have one property in here at the moment. Uh, 123 Main Street. If you want to see the video on how to create this property uh, website, just go ahead and watch that one in our how to videos. But make sure you pick the property website that you want the virtual tour to go into that property's MLS ticket, okay? So we're just going to create, uh, grab uh, the virtual tour for Main Street. And a quick shortcut to the link for the MLS compli compliant virtual tour is clicking these these uh, two uh, chain links. Click there and see where it says MLS compliant virtual tour. Click this, grab that, copy it. Okay, and then I need you to go into your MLS system, which we use RealComp. Okay and which is uh, ran or it runs the RCO3 and go to input along the top here click there and the agent that I'm using you know make sure you click uh, select the proper agent and then select your proper listing I'm just gonna pick the first one okay this will pop up and then see where it says manage virtual tours click there and this is simply where you're just gonna paste what we copied earlier so we're gonna right click we're gonna paste and then hit submit listing input succeeded and if you want to go check it out just click on the MLS number and right here is the actual virtual tour button. Ta-da! And this comes up. And again, as you can see, this is not branded for you or anything. Therefore, it's an MLS compliant virtual tour link, okay? But when somebody finds this property in Zillow or Trulia, or even if your broker's office syndicates to Realtor.com free for you, the client, the prospect, can actually click on the virtual tour through that ticket in Zillow or Trulia, and then a branded one will pop up, which looks like, uh, let's see, standalone virtual tours, which will look like this. It'll have your picture, it'll have your logo, you, they can click on to see the tour. Obviously, they're watching the tour, but they can go to the website, this property's website, you know, description on the property, the gallery, photo gallery. So this is very powerful because if you don't have a paid account through Zillow or Trulia, uh, you'll notice that other agents at the bottom or along the top right are pop popping up as suggested agents to contact. So. Uh, this is kind of a way to get your information secretly in there to reach out to the client. So that's how you create a MLS compliant virtual tour and put it into your MLS ticket. If you have any questions or concerns, feel free to email me anytime and I'd be more than happy to answer your questions. 
Thank you, and have a great day.